Every breath you've ever taken came from a tree. But what if tomorrow those trees stopped breathing for you? This isn't science fiction. This is the most dangerous what if you've never considered. What if trees stopped making oxygen? Trees perform one of the most essential functions on Earth photosynthesis. They take in carbon dioxide water and sunlight and release life oxygen. 28% of Earth's oxygen comes from land-based plants. The Amazon alone contributes 20% but they also regulate climate, purify air host biodiversity, and balance global ecosystems. Imagine waking up to a world without trees, a world where the air feels heavy and breathing becomes a struggle. Each tree is a powerful ally in the fight against climate change, absorbing harmful gases and providing a refuge for countless species. In their absence, ecosystems would crumble and life as we know it would face devastating consequences. Without trees, the very fabric of our environment would unravel, leaving a barren and lifeless existence in its wake. Now imagine this, every tree on Earth suddenly stops performing photosynthesis. No more oxygen production. Within hours, levels begin to shift. Carbon dioxide builds. Oxygen falls. We start to feel it in our lungs. Confusion, dizziness, fatigue. Below 195% oxygen, we lose cognitive function. Below 16%, we collapse. Most people don't realize we don't have a huge storage of oxygen. It needs to be constantly replenished. Oceans produce much of it through phytoplankton, but they too are dying. If trees stop, oceans won't save us. The reality of an oxygen-deprived world becomes stark as lives hang in the balance. The urgency of the crisis drives humanity to seek solutions before it's too late. Day one brings an unsettling sensation. We feel lightheaded as firefighters report inefficient combustion amid growing concerns about air quality. On day three, planes begin to struggle at altitude and hospitals are forced to ration oxygen tanks as the air grows heavier. By day seven, coastal cities report alarming marine life deaths and birds fall mid-flight, leaving communities in disbelief. On day ten, governments declare martial law as agriculture begins to fail, forcing society to confront the harsh realities of this ecological crisis. The ecological domino effect becomes evident. Without trees, desertification accelerates leading to famine as nature's balance collapses. As pollinators die and predators starve, ecosystems unravel leading to a bleak future for both nature and humanity. The world is at a crossroads as we ponder a future that hinges on